Hello everyone, if you're interested in wrestling, then you probably know the name Leilani Kai. Her career was like a roller coaster, and Leilani herself was one of the best female wrestlers of the 80s. But besides spectacular fights, she was also famous for her scandals and anyone who dared to offend Leilani would soon regret it. Today we will tell you about the three biggest scandals in the professional career of WWF wrestler Leilani Kai. Enjoy watching! In the third place in our ranking is the story that Leilani told in one of her late interviews after she ended her career as a wrestler. It concerns the fabulous Moolah, of course. They were united by a difficult relationship that was initially good. Early on in Moolah's career, she trained Kai and helped her with her promotions. But as Leilani developed, their relationship gradually deteriorated and eventually turned into deceit, greed, contempt and hatred. At one stage of their career, Leilani and her teammate Judy Martin were even stripped of their titles due to the fabulous Moolah's setup. By the way, you can find out about this case and many other interesting events from the career and life of Leilani Kai in the previous video. Ok, let's get back to our story. One day when Leilani was in the dressing room with her colleagues, their agent came to them and turned to Moolah with the words that he received a money order for Kai and other girls. At that time, the wrestlers gave a percentage of their profits to Mula, but had no idea how big it was, since she spoke with an agent about financial matters far from their ears. But that evening, they managed to eavesdrop on Mula talking to an agent through a thin wall. The agent said that he received $150 per week for each girl. Sometime later, when Mula gave out a salary, Kai and other wrestlers received only $50 a week. According to Leilani, after that she stopped respecting her, but unfortunately, at that time she could not do anything about it. It was this incident that became one of the main pushes, after which their relationship began to worsen greatly. The second place is occupied by a very dirty story, and it's literally dirty, and now you will find out why. Professional wrestling booker Vincent Russo is involved in it. Just look how much Leilani Kai hates him. Who are you? F you! You, Vince Russo. The thing is, Vincent wanted her to do mud wrestling. One day, Leilani arrived at the event in Colorado to fight a girl named Brandy Alexander and was told at the last minute that she would have to fight in the mud. For Leilani, this offer was unacceptable and she rudely refused it. Now she says she'd give anything to get in the dirt with Vincent Russo and beat him up good. The thing is that such fights in the mud could greatly harm young talents and negatively affect their future careers. Now Leilani hopes that Vincent did not fully realize what he was doing, but her hatred towards him has not yet subsided. And before you know the case that won the first place of our top, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Leilani Kai approves of your choice, and as for us, we continue. This story is quite recent. It happened in 2014 at the end of Kai's career. A lot of wrestlers in the final stages of their careers disappear from the radar and almost nothing is heard about them. But not Leilani Kai. At the age of 54, she decided to take part in the West Coast Wrestling Connection and face Kylie Sutton. But to the great regret of Kai and to the admiration of the public, this match was not destined to take place. The fact is that a week before the fight, Leilani changed her mind about taking part in it and forced the manager Johnny Fairplay to take her place. But that match didn't take place either, as Sutton won the match by DQ after Kai entered the ring and attacked her before the referees pulled her off. Aggression was caused by a joke from Kylie Sutton regarding Kai's advanced age. The audience was delighted and although Leilani formally lost this fight, she left the ring with her head held high, once again proving that she would never allow anyone to laugh at her. Write in the comments what you think about it, whether you condemn Kai's behavior in this case or support her. This was the last story for today, you were on the Star Patrol channel and see you in the next videos.